Hey, right. I'm in. Hey there, everybody. I'm Blake Lubers, editor for the Popprint newspaper at tcpopprint.net, and we're starting a new video series today. And it's just gonna be video game reviews. We're gonna try to do it once a week. That uh, will give you like, a timetable what day we're going to do it every week. But we're going to do one video game every week. It's be a short video where we kind of explain video game, talk about it, and so yes. So in honor of the release of Halo 4, we're going to be doing Halo Reach, of course. Why not? And um, don't want to spoil anything for anyone. Want to do that? I don't want to spoil anything for anyone, so I'm going to start out on the first level, just to make it fair to everyone. So, for those of you who've been living under a rock, uh, Halo Reach is a sci-fi game. It is the, I believe it's the fourth or f no, it's like the fifth game they've created in the Halo series. There was one, two, three, ODST, and Wars. So this is the sixth. And it is set as a prequel to Halo 1. So before the Master Chief trilogy. And it focuses on the adventures of Noble Team that is stationed on the planet Reach and they're attempting to defend the planet from the Covenant, the evil group. And so, cutscene. Listen up, Noble Team. We're looking at a down relay outpost 50 clicks from Visegrad. We're going to introduce ourselves to whoever took it out. Helicopters. And get it back online. Get me under the hood, Commander. Sir, why would Rebels want to cut off reach from the rest of the colony? You got a chance, maybe you can ask him, George. So this is Reach, or a piece of it. It's a nice planet. almost a tutorial if you think about it alright yes I love these settings they're so amazing let's see what I'm doing okay. alright so this is just gonna be the beginning of the mission we're just gonna set the choppers down and get going eventually come on I get out now. Let's go, six. Yeah. Alright. All right, no so here's your basic mainframe. You've got this is your heads up display. You've got your health bar, your shield bar. Uh get your weapon info. Primary. Secondary. Got grenades. Oh, we don't have grenades in this, but normally we do have grenades. Uh, we have a warthog that's on fire. Uh, we have our armor ability. Sprint. Our multiple others. A jetpack. Evade, which is uh, kind of a ninja roll. Uh, hologram, which shoots out a fake version of you. It's good in games online to fool people. There's active camo, which is a... that turns you invisible, but only when you're standing still. It's nice for snipers. And, ah, oh, there's one more. Oh, drop shield. There's drop shield, which basically just puts a little mini shield around you. And then there's armor lock, which is probably the most infamous. Ah, oh, bird! Bird! 
I know, Pete is going to be all over me. So we're just going to kind of follow what they tell us to do. Just kind of walking around. Stairs. Dangerous. There's no arm rail there. Uh, it's not that dark, but for situations that are dark in campaign, if you hit the left D-pad, you have access to a night vision, which is good for some missions where you will be in the dark. Civilians. We're not getting into much action right now, but we will. Alright, where are we headed? Looks like we're headed this way. And this is the first part of the mission where they do encourage you to use your sprint armor ability as it gets you places faster so we're just going to be doing that oh. this is the first use of your motion tracker your motion si your motion detector it allows you to see enemies but only when they're moving it gives you a good view of people when they're moving around but enemies that are standing still do have the element of surprise on you. Let me take the ramp, I'm lazy. Um, so it's not good for finding snipers, but it's great for finding enemies who just want to kind of run around and, you know, pick you off. So we're just going to kind of walk through this building. Uh-oh. Better break this window. And that is the first enemy we'll see. A jackal. And I took him down. So now this is the first bit of combat we have. These are Covenant Grunts. Ow. Come on. I want to get a headshot. Yay. That is the Grunt Birthday Skull I put on. Uh, gives you nice colorful confetti. Oh, there we go. I picked up two grenades. And grenade. And gotcha. Use the left bumper on your controller to do that. Oh. Oh, Grunt. No. No. Come on. Do. No. I want to perform assassination. Fine, I'll just do it the boring way all day long. Okay, shields are down. This is a part of the game that kind of differs from, that kind of puts the sci-fi aspect into it. Instead of just a health bar, you've also got a layer of energy shields protecting you. That is the top bar on the very top. Uh, there are energy shields that will deplete as you are being shot at, but it's kind of your force, your your foresight against enemies who are attacking you. Just your shields. That is your first layer of defense. Hey, don't steal my kill. It's like a guy playing Call of Duty. So now we, you now if you've noticed at the top left of the screen, we do have two versions of grenades. We have the normal frag grenades. And we have Covenant Sticky Grenades. Uh, you know, if you couldn't guess by the name. They stick to your opponents. Kinda like that. I stuck it to his arm. Oh, yeah, you better run. Run! Oh. Okay. So now, this is where the energy shields really do come in handy when you're in a large firefight like this, and the enemies are all around you. No. Ah. Uh, making no fun, you guys. No. You can also, yes, you can, you saw that. You can pick up weapons. The side gives you weapon details, holding the assault rifle and the magnum pistol. These are kind of your basic weapon loadout. Uh, also, if you haven't noticed, your health does not automatically regenerate. Your shields will automatically regenerate over time, but your health within certain parameters will not automatically regenerate. Alright, so, I'm just gonna go I'm gonna ford the river. And, I think there are foes over here. Yep. Aw, oh, a guy almost got in my way. See, teammates do not respect you in this game. They just feel like they can just do what they want and get in your way. Come on, stick him. Ah, oh, PETA's all over me again. Killing, oh, okay, here we go. These are the first major enemies you will be combating against. These are Covenant Elites. They are pretty much the Spartans of the Covenant Empire. They have the same energy shields as we do, and they have powerful damage resistance. 
similar weapon loadouts. Commander, whole nine yards. Ah, oh, I'm with you, northeast. cool skull dude. Okay. So, okay, first experience driving a vehicle. Uh, this is just a truck. Don't have any weapons. Until Jorge gets on. Well, I'm not gonna go without this guy. Trying to be disrespectful to the leader. I see you just want to take charge. Just gonna be driving. Driving. Ah, running over more birds. I'm sorry, Peta. I'm sorry. Also, I am a terrible driver. Go. Run, birds. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay. Wow, that bird just like ignored my vehicle completely. He's just like, whatever. <laughs> oh, oh, rock. Is this the base we're going? Yes. This is where they told us to go. Oh, no, no. Please tell me that's not on my face. Okay. Please get the... No! Mm. Oh, coming in elite, elite, elite. Alright, I'm just gonna beat up these grunts, because they aggravate me. Okay, let's get one shot on you. Fine. You can be on fun, and I'll just accept that. But I really don't want to die today. Okay, I'm just gonna kind of run. Come on, avoid the elites, avoid the elites. Find a health pack, find a health pack, okay. These health packs are the only things in the game that can regenerate your health. And I think I saw an elite in there. Sick of dead. Nope. Ah, I got him. Yeah. Looks like we're clear. Alright, so back to the driving. Uh, wow, look, look at the, the truck managed to make it through all that. Oh, wait, no. Oh, my bumper. Those Covenant messed up my bumper. And I just got it painted. I'm not asking for directions. Ignore all the wildlife. Alright, uh, let's go this way. Someone. Ow. Uh, is it here? Is it here? We're just gonna park right here. Alright, let's do it! Almost hit my guy. Alright, this truck's just... That's a good place to park my truck. Alright, let's throw grenades and get out of here. So we get some nice large scale combat. Okay, running grunt. This is this is the perfect opportunity. There we go. Special animation for uh kills from the back. That's called an assassination in this game. Yes, oh nope. No, I will punch you. <laughs> so I'm gonna hang out in this building now, see what's going on. Ordinance. Okay, here we go. New weapon. This is a DMR, Designated Marksman Rifle. So you can see... No! Well, fine, you get to live. It gives you... Wow! It gives you a good aim. Alright. Get some more combat. It's... Kind of an, an upgraded pistol. I'm not good at using it. Just thought I'd let you all know I'm, I'm bad at using the DMR. Alright, punch. Ah, punch again. I just love punching them. Oh god, no, no. Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. Oh no, 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 no. Well, why does everyone else come with armor lock? That's not fair. I just heard the little, uh, little sound that it makes when you activate armor lock. I don't see why all my teammates get armor lock and I'm stuck with sprint. Hey, see? It seems unfair that everyone else gets cool. No one else gets the cool armor abilities, and I'm just stuck with sprint. No! Okay, I thought that was on me. That freaked me out there. Ah. Ah. I'm getting bad at this. I don't see why, but it's happened to me throughout forever that I just seem to be bad whenever I'm recording a video of playing games. I just start doing terrible. I think it's the pressure. Oh, wow, wow. That was close. I'm just gonna throw every grenade I have and hope I get someone. Did I get him? Did I get him? Did I get him? Oh, no. Of course I didn't. Punch. Ah, uh, see his blood is purple. That's kinda cool. And I just unlocked an Xbox achievement. I think that's for... 
kills with the pistol. And well, where were they? Where did they go? What? Did they're they died? Well, that's a oh, choppers, yeah, choppers. Do I get in this one? Which one do I? What the heck? Oh, <laughs> which one do I get in? Fine, y'all take all the other seats. I'll get this one. I see how it's going to be. Well, no. I'm confused. I thought that was my seat. All right, so these guys are all showcasing different kinds of armor that you can buy. Every bit of armor that these guys have is available for purchase in the armory through the game. You can, you know, I, I believe I have this helmet and this helmet, but not his helmet. And I have the other two's helmet as well, but not the skull on it. You have to like do something to get the skull. But okay, more combat. Can I just, uh, can I just jump out from here? Can I just, just kind of ninja roll on me on the ground? Well, I guess I can't. We're just going to kind of scoot along. Okay, so I'm going to go a different way than everyone else is going to go. I'm going to go up here, because I know there is ammo, and not that way, but there's, yeah, right here. This door has armor lock, and I thought it had a different weapon in it. I know there's something up here that you can use that's good. There's the DMR as well is a nice thing to do. Nice thing to have, but we can sit here. These are jackals that have little shields. You have to kind of aim at the... Man, I do not have an aim today with this. Okay, we're just going to wait around here. I'm just going to jump down and see what we got going on down here. Oh, uh, we have a forklift. I love forklifts. Oh, it's this grunt. Alright, I'm going to actually pick up this Grunt's Needler and look around for some more. Alright, Cat hacked the door, I believe in you. I don't believe in her, but, you know, I gotta, I gotta stay positive in this game. Okay, so I'm gonna run around. If you walk over a weapon that you already have, like this one, it will disappear and you will get ammo from it. This weapon is a Covenant Needler, and it's gotta be one of my favorites because of the fact that it locks on to your opponents. And well, where did you come from? And now I'm scared. See, and when you unload enough shots, this guy is ignoring me. Hey, you do not ignore my existence. I love my existence, okay? You can't just ignore me. It's like my wife. <laughs> uh, got you in your back. Got you in your side. Oh, we're in? Oh, that's nice. I'm just gonna run now. I'm just going to run for my life now. I don't know what the rest of y'all are gonna do. Oh, that's back on the ground. Don't eat it. What? Oh, on door. Close faster. Come on. Come on, Jorge. Get in here. You got this. I'll keep... Emil? No. Man, Emil. Get, get back in. Get in. Get... No. 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 What? 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 No. Well, great. He's outside. So here is the fourth point of the mission where you have to turn on your night vision. Or well, you don't have to, but... Alright. Cutscene. Let's see what we got here. Aww, person. We got split. I don't think they... It sounded bad on the cops. No, right, cool. person, Stay man. Quick. We'll get you a combat surgeon. Damn. Plasma damage. Found something. I'll take that, Six. Not your domain. I got a live one over here. Uh, Come on. Uh, That's a car. Yeah. Ooh, we switched to widescreen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Falcon punch. Yeah. The armor. Oh, That's a smart. Yeah. It's all right. Uh, We're not gonna yeah. hurt you. We're on your yeah. side. George, I got her. Keep still, yeah. and I'll release you. Oh. What's the It's over. We've been engaged. Guy coming out. Falcon punch. That was not the weapon I had. Fine. I guess someone stole my weapon. That tangle group has permission to pursue. Negative four 
four, stay on the entrance. Two, handle her. Five and six, clear the hole. Let's get rocking and rolling. Wait, why do I have to go? Can I stay back with you guys? Why you close the door? Oh, don't close the door. Well, now I'm stuck. I can't bail. This isn't even what I wanted to do with my life. There were plenty other things I could have done with my life, but nope. He's my mom's like, join the army! That would be fun! Alright, Grunt. Let's see if I can get him. Ow! Oh, what? Well, you love grenades so much! I'm gonna give you one! I'm gonna hang out here. I don't know if there's any weapons I can grab, but I'm just kinda wondering. Oh no, Jorge, you lost his shields. You can kinda sneak around the back here. How's it going? How you doing? How you doing? Like some bullets! Hey, hey. Oh, sorry, Jorge. I didn't realize that was you. thought that was a guy I had to punch. Alright. Final section. Yay! 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 So fun. What are you shooting at, Jorge? I got this. Alright. Coming, coming, um, oh god, energy sword guy. Okay, yeah, okay. Jorge, save me, Jorge, save me. Oh yeah, got him. And I got his sword. And there's a drop shield down there. You can get... There's a shotgun, which is nice to have. Uh... How do I get back up? Oh, staircase. Alright. So, I think this is the last part of the mission. Uh... Ow! Ow! Whoa. That was, a. Uh... Wow, that almost... <laughs> I almost messed that up again. <laughs> oh, wow. I ended the mission, but wow. Oh, I almost messed that up again. <laughs> okay, so... Looks like we just ended it. All right. A little security oh, footage. Question of my life. If the question is when will the station be back online, two weeks earliest. This is plasma damage. All major uplink components are fried. Two minutes is too long. Which is why I'm splicing into the main Overland bundle to get you a direct line to Colonel Holland. You're in my light, Commander. Wow. She's rude. Find out what she knows. I'll talk to your commander like that. Okay, so overview. You enjoyed this video. <laughs> We're gonna be doing this every week. What's your name? Uh, next video What's should be Minecraft. And I never yeah, so you can Shada. look forward to that. Shada. And we would be interested to take suge Shada. suggestions from people Shada. on what they would want to see. So you can always do that. Stop either me or Chris James in the hallway or drop by the newspaper room. So, yeah, we'll take any suggestions. Might not do them. Might not have the game, but, <laughs> you know. Alright. Tension. It's like a hidden love story. This is a boring cutscene. Signa, it's patchy, but it's there. I'll take it. Let's not touch anything. We wouldn't want to ground this place. All right, so should be the end. She got a robot arm. If you hadn't noticed, it's yeah, nice. Dude, what's your situation? Over, Colonel. This is Noble One. There are no rebels. The Covenant are on reach. Acknowledge. Come again, Noble One. Did you say Covenant? Affirmative. I think it's we'll just end it right about here. Uh, don't forget Halo 4 comes out November 6th. So, uh, you know, flip a coin, heads you vote, tails you go get Halo 4. <laughs> it's just that simple. And always check out our site, www.tcpoprint.net. And see you next time. How about I drive a forklift into you guys? Yeah.
Oh, ow, 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 ow. I had flattened. Did I get him? And I died. Yep, that's what happens. Don't trust forklifts, kids. Don't trust forklifts. Yeah, okay, where's who's left? Oh, you? What? He dropped. Wow, that makes me feel bad. 